Germany is preparing to make one of its biggest modern air defense investments, and it's all about countering drones. Reports reveal that Rheinmetall is awaiting a massive $79 billion contract from the German Armed Forces for its Skyranger anti-aircraft gun systems, with deliveries planned through 2035. Defense analysts estimate this could mean between 500 and 600 units, a scale not seen in decades for German short-range air defense. The Sky Ranger 30 represents a capability Germany largely abandoned after retiring the Gepard self-propelled anti-aircraft gun in 2010. Yet the war in Ukraine has been a wake-up call. German-supplied Gepards, armed with twin 35mm cannons, have proven highly effective against Shahed-type drones and even cruise missiles. Now with drone threats multiplying, Berlin is bringing back a mobile gun-based defense. Mounted on an 8x8 Boxer armored vehicle, the Sky Ranger 30 carries a 30mm revolver cannon with programmable airburst ammunition, capable of shredding drones, rockets, and mortars up to 1.8 miles away. Germany's variant will also fire Stinger surface-to-air missiles, combining rapid-fire precision with missile reach. The system's Spexer 2000 radar can detect targets up to 25 miles away, even tiny drones, and works alongside advanced electro-optical sensors for fast target identification. Compared to the Gepard, the Sky Ranger is more deployable, cheaper to maintain, and adaptable for various roles, from battlefield escort to point defense of critical infrastructure. It's also part of Germany's multi-layered air defense strategy, covering everything from ballistic missiles to nanodrones. The decision to invest in such a large number of Sky Rangers also reflects Germany's broader rearmament push following Russia's invasion of Ukraine. Berlin has pledged to modernize its armed forces after decades of budget cuts, and air defense has emerged as a top priority. The growing use of low-cost drones by both state and non-state actors has shown that traditional missile-based systems alone are not enough. Gun-based systems, like the Sky Ranger, can deliver a high rate of fire at a lower cost per shot, making them ideal for countering mass drone attacks. Rheinmetall's design also offers flexibility for future upgrades. The turret can be adapted to larger 35mm cannons, integrated with different missile types, or even fitted to tracked vehicles like the Lynx or Leopard for heavier protection. There's also the possibility of adding directed energy weapons, such as high energy lasers in the coming years, to tackle smaller drones without expending costly ammunition. This modular approach ensures the Sky Ranger remains relevant as threats evolve. Beyond Germany, Austria has already ordered the system, while nations like Lithuania, Denmark, and Hungary have shown interest. Future upgrades could even see Sky Rangers mounted on Leopard tanks or integrated with advanced non-kinetic defenses. For now, Germany's investment signals a major shift, reintroducing a mobile anti-aircraft gun capability at a time when drone warfare is rewriting the rules of air defense.